A woman is thankful to be alive after being the victim of an early morning shooting in Lafayette. Lafayette police responded to the 800 block of Martin Luther King Drive last week around 1 o'clock in the morning. Police discovered a woman with multiple gunshot wounds. Today, she is recovering. News 10's Rodrika Taylor sat down with the victim. She joins us now in the studio with a story only on 10. Eight-year-old Zalea says she was planning to do her friend's hair the day the shooting happened. She says she didn't know it would be the day she would get shot. I really didn't think I was going to make it, to be honest, but the only thing I could have think about is my two kids. Fryer says she was at her friend's home when the shooting took place Thursday morning. They was fussing or whatever, and he was, she told him to leave, so he left. But by the time like, I was leaving, I was looking to go home because I was supposed to do a hair that day. He came back and started shooting. She says the suspect shot seven to ten times. Fryer says she was hit in her thigh and wrist. I'm the only one got hit four times. I really didn't want to die. Like that's all I kept thinking about. Cause like I that's my that's the first time that happened to me. So I didn't know what to expect. She says she thought her life was over, but is grateful for the security guard who stepped in to save her life. Thank you so much for getting there quick enough to save my life. Like he just was crying and stuff, and like showed the most support. And was like I know it's like I know it's, it's gonna hurt, but you gotta do it. And just started wrapping me up and just did what he had to do and I was just like, just do it, please, just do it. Just, as long as you save my life, I don't care, just do it. And he did it, hurt it so much. The 18-year-old says as she moves forward in life, her mindset has changed. Stay to yourself and stuff like that and just, just stay still low, do low. Like, because you never know what to expect or who to trust. Because I did not expect that to happen. I did not know he was that type of person to do that. Authorities say they have narrowed down a suspect. If you have any information about the shooting, contact the Lafayette Police Department. Rodrika Taylor, KLFY News 10. Thank you, Rodrika.